We were traveling and relied on filling up water at different places. This is the TDS meter that we relied on and highly recommend. But there are some things to note. So 264, we at one point filled up with really hard water from like a well, had lots of minerals. So that's why I think mixture of that water and this water is showing a higher value on the TDS meter. We're gonna see what it is after this filter. And of course, TDS is not the most reliable way to measure the quality of water, obviously, because the quality of water depends on a lot of things. 250. I like it. Can you imagine it? This filter takes 100 points. Off of it? Yeah. Hmm. In this particular case scenario. So we do have other ways of testing the water. Basically put a strip in and you can see the lead, alkalinity, pH, and kind of get a feel for it. So with this and the TDS meter, you can kind of get an idea of the purity of the water, which of course, even with these two, you should not rely that the water is 100% pure because we all know that there's so many contaminants in water nowadays, so many so many contaminants and water is so precious. 